Hello, everybody! I am C. Rob the Platinum One. Doing stuff. Doing awesome stuff! And just doing stuff. Welcome back to more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3 Heart Run. In the last part, we completed the Water Temple and got ourselves the Water Medallion. Thank God! And today, we're going to head off to our next destination, which is Kakariko Village. So, while I'm going there, I'm going to tell you a little bit of a story about the most epic anime fan dub I've ever heard in my life. And we should take this off. Okay. Okay, so, I've been getting into Oron High School Host Club lately, and I gotta say, it's a good anime. It's a good anime. Especially since it's dubbed by <coughs> Funimation. <coughs> anyways. Anyways. I've heard this fan dub. He. I mean, Vlad. He said, ah, ah, get off, get off, get off, get off. Get off. Bad touch. Anyways. This girl. This girl. YouTube user named X Magic Tricks X. Does a perfect Honey Senpai voice. It's like. Oh my god, it's so epic. It's so epic, man. And she was doing the episode where where Honey Senpai gets a cavity. Gets a cavity. It's episode 12. And just when she begs, what a blap, he she it. Just when when she does the part where Honey Senpai begs how how do he for for a candy? It's like what the heck? I could just shed a tear. Holy crap. <laughs> Shut up, Nappy. You're ruining it. It's just... I feel so bad for Honey Senpai. I want to give him a sweet, even though... Even though... Even though he got a cavity in that episode. <laughs> I'm still laughing at that. <laughs> so anyways, if you want to see her fan dubs... X, I'll put the link in the description or an annotation. I'll decide which is which after this part. Okay, so let's head off to Kakariko Village. And whoa! Jeez. It's on fire. It's official. This is the worst place to live. here so fast. Video game logic. Get back, Platinum. Okay. Why? Oh no, we're about to see she fi oh no. Dang it, I thought we were gonna see she fight. Oh well. Wait, shouldn't the rain put out the fire? Seriously. Okay, and like five minutes later, the fire is put out. Thank God. Looks like you're coming around. And the rain stops. Sounding. Platinum, a terrible thing has happened. The evil shadow spirit has been released. Impa, the leader of the Kakariko village, has sealed the evil shadow spirit in the bottom of the well. But the force of the evil spirit got so strong, the seal of the well escaped and escaped into the world. Of course! I believe Impa has gone to the Shadow Temple to seal it again, but she will be in danger without any help. Platinum, Impa is one of the six sages. OMG spoilers! You destroy the evil Shadow Spirit and save Impa! That was like a terrible spoiler! I mean, seriously! What the heck? The only thing I can do for you is to teach the melody that will lead you to the Shadow Temple. This is the melody that will draw you into the infinite darkness that absorbs you in time. 
Listen to this, the Nocturne of Shadow, and be absorbed into the infinite darkness, and even absorb Stiago's time. Okay. Shut up, chickens! You're ruining the moment! Let me take care of the village. I'm counting on you, Platinum. Okay. Oh yeah, that's taking real good care of the village! Jeez! Man, you're the worst person ever, period. Okay. So anyways... There's actually nothing else for us to do. The only thing we can do... It's to go back in time! Yes, these next two temples will actually require you to... Require... Require... Blah! Will actually require you to go back in time in order to do something first. So, let's go to the mass... Let's go back to the pedestal of time in order to, uh... Do something. Yeah. And now we don't have the power! Oh great, I, I miss puberty. Okay. So anyways, let's play the Nocturne of Shadow now. This is actually the only legit way to get to the entrance to the Shadow Temple. But, we're not going to the Shadow Temple yet. No, no. Because there's actually something for us to do. We actually have to do something first. Because you see, that bottom of the well is where, where the Shadow Beast was from. And in that, in that well is a certain item we need in order to, act, in order to uh, get through the temple. If you're feeling really bold, you can, you actually can get through the Shadow Temple without the item, but, but just to be on the safe side. Anyways, we end up at question, question mark. And now what we gotta do is play the Song of Storms. Remember, you can only enter the bottom of the well as a kid, not an adult, because the entrance to the bottom of the well will be sealed off. And somehow, even though technically it's raining, and it shouldn't... Well, you know water level shouldn't drain, it should rise. Once again, video game logic shines through. Okay. And, geez, we still haven't recovered those hearts. God. Okay. So, anyways, here we go. So, in a sense, I guess if you're going for 100%, this dungeon is required, but I'm not I'm rather not going for 100% here. I'm just trying to beat the game with three hearts, like I said previously. Anyways, got to talk to this thing. I can hear the spirits whispering in this room. Look for the Eye of Truth. That's what they are saying. Anyways, it looks like you can't go through here, so I guess you can go, or not, because that wall is really fake. So now, basically, this is the main hub. Um, despite there being gold skulltulas here, I'm not gonna cover this dungeon quite 
part really. I'm not really going to cover this dungeon. Just because it's a little sub dungeon and it's not really one of the main dungeons of the Whoa. There was something here? Oh. There was just something. Iron bars. Yeah, if you get small keys here, you can actually open doors that lead to ow. Sculptula, you die. Thank you. And whoa! Giant flaming skulls. Now I've known I now I've known I'm taking a lot of crap. Okay. So anyways, play Zelda's lullaby right on this spot right here. And the water level will drain. So I apologize, Mega Mario Striker. I know you I know you want to get through this game, but I'm not gonna cover this dungeon. You on your own. <laughs> Just kidding. It's because, well, this dungeon isn't really, doesn't really feel like it. It's more of a sub thing. Like I said before, it is required to get 100%, but I'm not really feeling like covering this dungeon just because I want to get through the main story. So anyways, go near these hands. They look creepy. Look at Holy! Ah, it's getting on me! Ah, holy crap! What the heck? What the heck is that thing? What the heck is that thing? Get off! Dead hand. Watch out for its infinite hands, even though it has six. Aim for its head! Okay. So this is dead hand. Some would you call a... The boss of the, uh... Bottom of the well. Each time he disappears, you have to, uh... You have to, uh, grab, make those hands grab you. Make its hands grab you, yeah. And you have to, like, rotate the control stick or do whatever the frig you want to, uh, set yourself free. And to my knowledge, you can actually use the, uh, ow. You can use the, holy crap, he's right behind me. He's right behind me, get off. Thank you. And now he's go he goes to die. In his proud little world. And watch him plant. You got the lens of truth. This is the lens of truth. Set it to C and press C to look through it. Mysterious things are hidden everywhere. Be sure to try it outside the well. Seeing the truth will cost magic power. Basically, this is an item that allows you to see invisible things. Yeah, but don't worry about your magic power because it- Ow. Because if you have, like, the double magic meter, it costs, like, little by little magic. Magic, so... Yeah, you can use this for quite a while, actually. So, anyways... Look, see? Invisible passages. For the win. At least it's not for the lose. The only thing is, while you're using the Lens of Truth, you can't, um... You can't use your magic spin attack. With the blue thing and the jungle thing and whatever. Whatever, I'm done with this. I'm gonna leave. Whatever. If I can remember. Okay, so that pretty much wraps up this part right here. So anyways... Next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina Time 3 Heart Run. We are going to commence the Shadow Temple dungeon thing. Whatever. See you guys next time.